Guys, the day has arrived. OMG, we're so excited. So we're back in production now. I'm going to show you the laser printer. I got this for Joel for Christmas last year. I saw him eyeballing videos on this thing and I knew he had to have it. Okay, so there's a little bit of a hidden agenda because I knew he was gonna make me really cool things. Anyway, right now he's working on a project for somebody else. Take it away, Joel. Hello. <laughs> okay. Goofball. So, as we were talking, we were trying to build, you know, that here is our rudimentary enclosure for the laser engraver. So lift the lid. See, it's all in here. So oh, we have it's all in here. the exhaust fan going out. Uh, like I said, it's it's working for what we're doing and it's working great. We've already done some tests, that kind of thing. Getting ready to do a tumbler. Um, so I've got everything kind of set up. And the image that I thought would look kind of cool is elk in the mountains. And I can't really I see can it because it's sideways, but you guys you guys will see it here real quick. So let me do I thought you were just doing names on these ones. Well, on on the one for the customer, yes. But I wanted I need to test it to see how well it burns into that paint. Oh, so you're doing it on the one they gave you. Correct. Oh, very cool. So that is what so is. is that going to wrap around the tumbler That's all the way as a scene? A, or? If not right at, it'll be pretty close to a complete wraparound. Okay. All right. So that is just a line burn. If we do a fill, it's only going to take a minute and 33 seconds. Well, let's just let's see what happens. If we do a fill, it's going to take a little bit longer. So we'll get started here. Turn the exhaust fan on. And he's yep. got the tumbler down in here. Got a coffee cup up against the bottom of it because the rollers tend to make these slide on the rollers. Okay? Okay. So. Guys, it's, it's a laser, so I can't really show you. I'll, I'll burn out my camera and my retinas. No, we can do it this way. So if you take this. You just swung them all the way around. Oh, You're making man. the people's dizzy. Oh, sorry. Going. Where am I going here? What I are need you to go. Doing? I need to do. Wait. Wait a minute. Hang dude, on. Dude. Dude. Hello. How's your nose look? No. Don't look you got at my boogies. Nose. So. You had boogies last week. I think week, we can do. Way. We do. Can we just do it like, like that? Okay. This. Yeah. We'll just do something like that. If you're right up above it, then you should be okay. You're not going to so see I'll the... So I'll stay with it. You're not going to see... All right. Ready? Okay, ready. Here we go. Go. Going now. Going pretty quick. Looking pretty good. Is it wrapping around the way you want it to? Uh, yeah, looks like it is. How tall of an image is it? I mean, what are the dimensions on it? Uh, it is two and a half inches wide by nine inches long. That oh, okay. That tumbler measures nine and one eighth of an inch in circumference. So it's just under the complete circumference. So it should be pretty close to being tip to tip. I am so excited.
Guys, when we bought this place down here, done. The big thing was that we would have plenty of space to be able to do all the things that we produce. And we've got very creative minds, so we needed a lot of space. Yeah. So it's a simple line drawing. Okay, that's way cool. That is pretty cool. Let me go uh, wash it off. It's got the soot on there from, from being burnt. So let me go wash it off real quick. This is the coolest thing ever in the history of our... You know what else is cool? I made my first batch of ham and beans today and my loaded bacon cheddar bread. You guys want to see it? Come on, I'll take you. We'll go look. Wow. Flip you around. So there's loaf one. I mean, it's, yeah, it is numbolicious. And here's what's left of loaf two. Lori came over and got some. Yep. We did a good even barter. Oh, did you show them the ham and beans? <laughs> what did not? I didn't show them the ham and beans. What you were going to show them? I'm a heathen. I, I don't know. All right. Yeah. First batch of ham and beans. First batch of ham and beans of the season happened today. Look at this mess. Oh, I am so hungry. Ah, uh, num. Num num. Yeah. I don't think Joel had ever been exposed to ham and beans before he met me. Oh no, I okay. was. So, there is the image etched into the paint. Isn't that cool? That's very cool, and if you put some detail in that, I mean, I, I kind of, I like it plain like this. You know, I like it as a line because it opens it up for logos and whatever you want to do up here. Right. And it doesn't detract from anything. And you, you can't feel anything. It's not. No. You can't feel. You can with fingernail, but other than that. Yeah, barely. So, I mean, it's in there. Yep. So that means it's it's dishwasher safe. It's not going to wash off. It's not going anywhere. It's permanent. So you can never redo another design over the top of that because, you know, it's permanent. But there you have it. Back into production. And I've got another client that wants to do a big job on some metal. Uh, I found out that I can't do Aluminum, can't mark aluminum, no matter what I was doing, can do stainless, but uh, I have to do a different direction with him on, on what he wants. Oh, we'll figure it out. So, Jinx says, yay, cool, all the beans. Jinxy, you What's your thing? Your thingy? No, do, do it this way. <laughs> 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 Sorry, buddy. I'll punch you really good. Yeah. Oh, sweet boy. I know. Life's a beach, and then you surf a little bit. Need a good boy. That's a good boy. All right.